Hey everybody, on um, April 2nd, 2019, at 6.57 p.m., I just want to come on and make a quick video. <clears throat> um, you know how us crazy Christians think, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, there is just no coincidences with Jesus, and whew, it is just amazing. Uh, this is... Of what he shows us and in the way he shows us it's truly crazy <laughs> to the world but not crazy to us who are crazy about Jesus right okay so um, I wasn't feeling very well and I had sat on the couch to wind down a little bit and actually had uh, a brother's dream that had just been sent to me that I was going to mirror for you all, and I will, okay, after this. But I wanted to share this first because this is literally what happened. It's amazing. <laughs> it's truly amazing. Oh, Lord. I'm sorry I'm sniffling. Today I should have had tissue. Um, okay. My Molly happened to step on my fire tablet the other night, and I don't know what she hit. I got to go back and find out. Um, but anyways, uh, she hit something that said how I could share uh, pictures from my camera uh, to the device and or to my phone. So I thought, well... Praise Jesus, that's really cool because that's exactly what I've been looking for. Um, so, wow, I'll get to figure that out. That was in a discussion I had with somebody yesterday. Um, and the remote happened to be there and a little hyper little critter that she is that I love so much um, had said, had uh, hit the remote and Jimmy Fallon came on, <laughs> which was odd because this is not a show I normally watch at all, but I guess it was on the channel. Well, Jimmy Fallon comes on at 10.35 uh, Central Time, so I know that this was after 11 when this happened. And it was perfect timing, as God's timing always is perfect, right? And what I saw, like, just totally blew my mind, especially those of you that were in the live feed the other night, and we were talking about the oldies and talking about how they have such significance now. <laughs> yeah. And if anybody jammed to the zombies... Uh, time of the season back then. I'm going to put a link in the description box to the actual video from the show that I watched last night. This was great, great. Because right then and there, Jimmy Fallon said that he was announcing the zombies. And what song did they sing? Time of the season. <laughs> I was like, Oh, thank you, Jesus. You're so awesome. Yes, we are in the season. And you can turn these words around, y'all. You know, uh, who's your daddy? Well, we know who our daddy is. He's Jesus. Is he rich like me? Of course he is. He owns a thousand cattle on a hill. Um, has he taken any time to show you? Yeah, he sure did. Long, he's been here all along. And he died on the cross, and yeah, he showed me how much he loves me. Um, but they look fantastic. They've aged gracefully, um, as many of us have in the Lord, right? Uh, amazing. So I just wanted to share that link with you. Also, um, let's say I just had a spell. 
right after this before I got to mirror a brother's video that I really wanted to share for encouragement, which I will do, okay? Um, and it was, well, let's just say it was a spell. And I don't call 911. I know Jesus is my 911. So I came out in the living room and, and prayed a while and talked to the Lord and went back to bed and I woke up today. So praise Jesus. Us watchmen are under severe attack and I'm going to have to draw the line. Uh, amazing stress. No more. When you find out that your brothers and sisters that you've called brothers and sisters for a long time and have helped and have been there for them, attack you, stab you in the back, it hurts really, really bad. But I take that on as my responsibility as uh, I shouldn't have let it go on so long on my part. As I have so many times, and I learned my lesson the hard way. I'm sorry, Lord. But I learned. And I got a stern warning from the Lord, and from a brother, and from several brothers, actually. Stop it with the stress. So, yeah, I am. And thank you to Sister Teresa, who alerted me on the uh, explosion in Texas today at the power plant. Um, I didn't get up until noon. Thank you, Jesus, I got up. And this happened at 11 o'clock. Can't make that up. And then the article um, that I'm going to post came out at 222 this afternoon. You can't make that up either, right? Um, so then, as I posted it in a group that I'm in, a brother happened to say, oh my gosh, I can't believe you just posted this because I just watched a, a dream from a brother and he talked about exactly this. So, in the link, I'll put the video uh, to the zombies from the Jimmy Fallon show last night in the time of the season. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> we are in the season, brothers and sisters. And I will, in the comments, post a link to the Texas explosion at the power plant, if you haven't seen it, in Crosby. And a confirmation dream from a brother. He talked about two places, Texas and New York. Okay, well, that first part of his dream has been fulfilled. Obviously, uh, all I know is that getting my dishes done, getting a loaf of bread made to eat with my baked potato soup that I have will be the, uh, <clears throat> and mirroring, of course, my brother's amazing dream that I'll share more about in my next video. Uh, for encouragement for us all that we need and prayers for us all that we need in Jesus name So I plead the blood of Jesus over this video. I plead the blood of Jesus for those who come and watch and If you remember the zombies in the song, it just might blow your mind if you really listen to the words and turn it into Look at the look at the Lord and all of it. Okay? Because you can turn a lot of these songs into the Lord, into Jesus songs, all right? And meaning. So, in the time of the season, yeah, I do believe we are in the season. Knowing about the six and what's going to be happening then. And then we got Passover right afterwards, right? So... This is Debbie from Texas saying, peace out. Maranatha, keep looking up. The king surely is coming. <laughs>